Hello, dear traders. We are glad to welcome you on InstaForex TV channel. You are watching Economic News with me, Tahmina Salomova. So, at the beginning of the coming week, the following macroeconomic statistics will be released. On Monday, China will publish its inflation data for August. Analysts expect the prices to rise by 2.2% in comparison with the previous year. In July, consumer inflation in China picked up from the previous month, largely due to a rise in known food prices. The consumer price index rose by 2.1% from a year earlier, beating expectations over 1.9%, but still within the government's comfort zone of 3%. On a month-on-month -month basis, the CPI rose by 0.3%. The IMF said China's headline inflation is expected to rise gradually to around around 2.5 percent, while producer price inflation would moderate. On Monday, Great Britain will release its GDP change data for July. In June, the UK economic activity slowed to 0.1 percent, down from 0.3 percent in May, despite its growth of 0.4 percent in the second quarter of 2018, on the back of the good weather. Since the Brexit vote in 2016, the UK has slipped from being the fast-growing economy in the J7 to the slowest. Nevertheless, the Bank of England, which raised interest rates, is likely to be comforted by the quarterly growth rate acceleration to 0.4%. In addition to these events, the following reports will be published early next week. On Monday, Japan is to share GDP data. The UK will release trade balance. On Tuesday, Great Britain will publish claim and count change and the unemployment rate. On Wednesday, producer price index will be out in the United States. You have watched Economic Calendar on InstaForex TV channel. We wish you profitable deals. See you next week.